The Austria's Green Lake is well known for its emerald green water. But did you know that for most of the year, this lake is actually a small forest park? During autumn and winter, the lake measures just three to six feet deep. But as the snow on the surrounding mountains melts, the lake basin begins to flood. Between mid-May and June, the lake reaches depths of up to 40 feet, submerging the adjacent parkland and making it a unique wonderland for scuba exploration. Jacob's Well is a perennial spring located in Hayes County, Texas. The 12-foot diameter mouth of the spring serves as a popular swimming spot for the locals and tourists who enjoy its striking scenic beauty and clear, chilly waters. However, beyond the inviting sunlit waters that countless people enjoy is an extensive underwater cave system, entering which has proved to be extremely dangerous. Cancun's Marine Park has been facing an increased tourism pressure and devastating effects of climate change, which are causing the declining of coral reefs. In an effort to lure away some of the tourists from the reef, the world's largest underwater museum was created. Consisting of over 400 permanent life-sized sculptures made using a special cement mix to encourage coral growth, the art-filled seabed is one of the most exciting artificial reef attractions. Stupendous subaquatic views are offered to divers as they float between the American and Eurasian continental plates off Iceland, the only place in the world where dives between continental plates are possible. The water originates from a glacier and is filtered through layers of porous lava rock before reaching the site. Due to the year-round cold temperatures of 35 to 39 degrees Fahrenheit and the water's purity, spectacular visibility accompanies divers as they swim through the Sulphur Hall, Cathedral and Lagoon. Palau is a 100-mile-long archipelago southeast of the Philippines, which offers world-class diving with seawalls, sheer drop-offs, caves, and an exuberance of marine life. Silky shark, manta rays, big-eyed tuna, marlin, and swordfish. Many popular dive sites host aggregations of reef sharks, which are composed mainly of resident gray reef and white tip reef sharks. Cyprus has one of the best dive sites in the world, the wreck of the Zenobia. Zenobia was a roll-on, roll-off ferry carrying trucks. More than 100 of these are still shackled in place, as when she went down. Nevertheless, it makes an outstandingly good dive, as it's still possible to sit in the cabs of trucks and recognize the remains of some of their cargoes. Once a secret gem for divers in Australia and the South Pacific at large, Papua New Guinea is now fair game as a prime scuba destination. The area has it all. No matter what you like, it has it all. From deep drops and shallow reefs to private lagoons and atolls. Amidst the reefs and schools of fish, one encounters numerous wrecks, a reminder of the violence and struggle during the tragic days of World War II.